I'm meteorologist Mark Mancuso, and on this day in weather history, September 13, 1928, a catastrophic Category 5 hurricane directly impacted Puerto Rico. It formed off the Cape Verde Islands and intensified as it crossed the Atlantic. Its lowest pressure bottomed at 929 millibars and had maximum sustained winds of 160 miles per hour. The hurricane killed 1,200 in Guadalupe and then moved over Puerto Rico with its winds expanding to a diameter of 243 miles. As it entered South Florida, it weakened. But powerful winds around 140 miles per hour caused a storm surge on Lake Okeechobee. A dike protecting a heavily populated low-lying area burst, flooding hundreds of square miles with up to 20 feet of water. 2,500 people were killed who had returned to their evacuated homes when the hurricane did not arrive on schedule. The hurricane caused over $100 million in damage at the time and remains one of the most intense landfalling hurricanes in the U.S. with a death toll over 4,000. I'm meteorologist Mark Mancuso.